Hi everyone! As you hopefully heard, the launch of Stratos 3 has been unfortunately delayed. It is now planned for Tuesday 24th of July at 8 p.m. The reason for this is that we're still waiting for an important element of the rocket. The element is called the flight termination receiver, which is a part of the flight termination system. This system is very, very important for a safe flight. What it'll do is it'll abort the flight if the safety criteria is exceeded. As you might have noticed, we keep on changing the date of the launch quite often. This is just because in rocket science everything happens really quickly and you can never know what will happen next. So I know it might be really confusing and really frustrating, but I have a solution for this. What you can do is you can sign up to get an email notification whenever the launch date changes. You can do it using the link below in the video description. And now, for the main part of this video, I will show you something really, really cool. What I will show you is an app, a Stratos app that our partner Xabia made for us. You can find our app in the App Store if you look up their Stratos 3. We have to move inside so you can clearly see everything that we're seeing. So as you can see, the app first scans the surroundings for a surface and then you can put a rocket here. So here you choose a scale. Let's start with a small one. And then you just place it here. It's fun. You can also choose a horizontal one. Now I'll show you my favorite part of this app. So what you can do is you can go full scale mode. Okay. First a vertical one. So this is exactly how the rocket will look before it's launched. Now I'll place the rocket horizontally. The coolest part of this app is that you can actually walk towards the rocket and when you get close enough, you can see the inside. The black thing here is the oxidizer tank. Now we're walking towards the engine, but very soon you'll see the connection between the engine and the oxidizer tank which is here. It's called the engine bay. This is how the oxidizer gets transported into the combustion chamber of the engine. Let's get closer and check out the recovery bay. This is still the tank. And voila. This is where all of the parachutes and the devices deploying them are located. Now this section is the flight computer. So this is what controls the rocket. So as you can see, the app is a lot of fun. Thanks to Xavia, you can now explore the design of our rocket. Make sure to follow us on Facebook and other social media to have all the latest updates and have the time of the launch so that you don't miss the live stream on the 24th of July.